Hello my student, this is Yasser Azam from Team LPS Sitapur. Today I am going to demonstrate the lecture on the topic types of soil from the chapter soil. This video is for class 7 and this is part 3rd of the chapter soil. Till now we have studied about formation of soil and we have also studied about the importance of soil which was really very easy to understand. You can go through the video twice and thrice and it will be you know clearing or it will clear your concept in a better way. For now what we have to understand, we have understood the process of weathering but weathering do not form a unique type, you know similar type of soil. There is difference in the particle size, on that difference we can say soil is basically of three types. The very fine, very micro particles we call it as clay particles and the soil formed by nature constituent of clay is called clayey soil. Then comes salt bigger than this one, then sand. Sand and clay individually they are not very good in you know fertility because they do not contain individually good amount of minerals but when they are mixed up together they form loamy soil which is really very good for the plants and it is rich in humus also. So we can say that but it is not so that clay and sand do not grow the plants alone. They have specific minerals some plants which, which uh, you know grow or needs a specific type of mineral may grow in them but for general we consider loamy soil as best soil. Now coming to next part soil and crop. Do you know that different crops need different types of minerals that's why you say some plants are growing uh, some fruits we get from India some we get from uh, you know different parts of India like Kashmir is growing apple we are not able to grow in UP. So different temperature type of soil minerals availability so many factors constitute the type of crop or type of food produced at a particular place. So soil also have different textures, different mineral constituents. So on the basis we can say that soil and crop are interlinked in terms of the specificity. Now when we talk about uh, you know sandy soil, sandy is lighter in weight but due to lighter in weight it is it is having large air spaces also so sometimes it is good for retention uh, but uh, uh, it is lighter, lighter in weight that's why when it gets dry it gets blown away by the wind also and water retention to you know very downwards not possible it only retain for some time and then it loses by evaporation so this soil is not very good for uh, growing plant okay next is clay clay what the problem is with the clay it is having very fine particles when water falls on it it collapses it forms you know uh, uh, air free uh, uh, what should I use a particular term just like a plastic covering okay do not have pore it becomes like that smooth textures come which do not allow water to seep out or to percolate as a result it leads to water logging pani upar jam jata hai pani upar reh jata hai theek hai aapne dekha hoga kai bar barish hoti hai water logging ho jati hai jahan pe zyada water logging ho rahi hai it means that that particular place is having clay soil in much amount other than that it do not you know have air spaces particle bahut pass pass hote hain air spaces na hone ki wajah se microorganisms do not able to grow properly in this soil which results in you know improper development of the plants because plants also do not get the proper amount of air. Next I have told you the merits of sandy soil it is low having low retention of water next it is have it blown away by the wind when it get dry. This was the third part now in last part we will be studying the different types of soil in India and chapter will be completed for then for till now you just be safe stay at your home again and again we teachers are saying the same thing and we believe that you are following also no need to you know waste your time you have a lot of time to do lots of creative work you can enhance your skill you can learn art you can learn so many different things keep searching google it for your positive development best of luck thank you so much